Everyone wants to learn bar spins. I wanted to learn bar spins. You probably want to learn bar spins. And the problem is everybody on YouTube teaches them differently. Grayson Roberts says just try harder. Anthony Panza says throw them switch. Like everyone just says different things. And the reality is that you don't know what you need to do until you figure out what it is. My issue with learning bar spins was that I could not get my other hand back on when I threw it. Other people's issues is that they're not pinching their knees. Other people's issues is that they're not going high enough. Other people's issues is that they're not level. And so everyone has a different issue when learning bar spins. And uh, Kajabika, Kajabika from the Discord, he says, does anyone have any proven instructions on how to learn bar spin? I watched many tutorials and everyone explains it differently. I can already do chicken bar spins, one-handers, seat grabs, tee bogs, X up, tuck no-handers. What's next? I also tried it from the pool. I'm not sure what he means by that. But the bike always flew off even when I tried to hold the seat with my knees. I'm frustrated and don't know what to do next. That sounds really frustrating, especially if he can do, you know, one-handers, seat grabs, T-bogs, X-ups, and no-handers. Like, you're pretty comfortable on the bike. You're pretty good at taking your hands off. You know how to do tricks. And so, to me, the next step is going to be bar spins. The problem here is that I don't know what you're doing wrong and there's so many things there. And so if you guys are having an issue with a bar spin, there's a link down in the description where you can submit a video of you trying the bar spin and then I can look over it and I can give you feedback. This is for free. You can do it one time. Our bike school members get to do this unlimited times and they get feedback on any trick that they want help with. But for you guys, like just just post or send that bar spin video in so I can check it out and give you some feedback because it's really frustrating. Um, I want to be able to help him, but I'm not exactly sure what it is. But I'll walk you through the thing that helped me the most and I think one of the biggest mistakes. Biggest mistake is that most people do not pinch their knees. You've got to pinch your knees when you throw your bar spin and keep your chest over the bars so that the bike stays in one place. If you're not pinching your knees and you're leaning backwards, what do you think is going to happen with your bike? It's going to shoot out from under you. That's just what happens because you're not staying over it and you're not keeping it, you're not staying in control of it. Okay, and so make sure that those knees are pinched so the bike doesn't dip to the side. Make sure your chest is over it so that it stays under you. That's the most important thing and I think a lot of people learning um, as a fear mechanism, they take their, they lean back when they throw the bar spin and it's never gonna work that way. You've gotta be confident, you've gotta stay over the bike, you've gotta stay in control. The problem that I had was that I would throw, I'd catch, and then this hand would be way over here. And I would never be able to get this hand back on. So I was doing it, throw, catch, take off my feet, because I was scared. Throw, catch, take off my feet. And, and this hand was still like just over here doing whatever, whatever hands do while you're doing a bar spin. So that was really frustrating. And what I had to do to fix it is I had to do bar spins without no pickup bars, no flyout bars. I just did it on the ground while I was rolling and it was scary. I thought I was gonna die and it worked. What I had to do to get it around on the ground was I had to bus drive it all the way around. I had to keep one hand on and just push it around there so that this hand was naturally coming back to the, to the grips. This hand wasn't coming off anymore. So I was dropping it back, throwing it around and catching. And it worked out perfect. I did that three times on the ground. I dropped in, I did it out of a small fly out first try. It, it, it was the craziest thing because I'd tried this trick for months and months and months never landing it. Then I did that practice exercise on the ground, threw it, landed it. It was, it was crazy. And so that was my experience. Everyone's going to be different. Everyone has a different issue with the bar spin. So I hope one of these two things help you, but if not, submit that video in the link again is in the description so I can help you land the bar spin. I want to help you guys get better. I want to help you learn tricks. So don't forget to do that. Now this question came from my BMX Nerds Discord. This Discord is a free Discord with over 800 like-minded BMX riders. Everybody in there wants you to progress, wants you to be better at riding bikes. And if you're not in the Discord, you're definitely missing out. So click the link in the description, join the free Discord, and we'll see you guys in the next video.